Taking our next guest, defense lawyer David Rudolph, into the spotlight. He is appearing tomorrow evening at the Bijou Theater at an event called Inside the Staircase, Lies, Face Science, and the Owl Theory. We're thrilled to have him in studio with us along with old-time friend. Uh, these guys go way back. Knoxville attorney James A.H. Bell. Thank you both for being here. And I just ask you, um, just the attention. This is on Netflix. It's become very popular. Um, are you surprised by how popular the docu-series is? I, I think I'm pleasantly pleased mm -hmm. by how popular it's been. I knew that Making a Murderer had gotten a lot of publicity and a lot of followers. Uh, you never know how one of these things is going to end up, uh, but it's been amazing. Uh, and not just here, you know, overseas, in Australia, in Israel. I get, I get, I get emails mm -hmm. from all over. How did you even get involved with this trial? Uh, well, uh, I had just finished the Ray Carruth case, which some people may remember. Huh? Yeah. Yes. Uh, and uh, they reached out to me because Michael's brother was a lawyer, and so he had uh, uh, heard about me and, and got in touch with me, and then uh, one thing led to the next. Were you apprehensive at all to take this on, or did you immediately jump at the chance to get involved? No, th this is one of those cases that uh, criminal defense lawyers like Jim and I uh, immediately right. jump on because you didn't even know if there was a crime here. I mean, uh, most cases, murder cases, it's a whodunit. In this case, it was what happened. Was there a whodunit? Right. And, and, and talk about how nice it is to have them in town and how folks can come see them. Well, uh, they can come by the Bijou uh, uh, tomorrow night, and uh, it's really nice to be with David. Uh, we talk often and much. He's a great friend, but he's truly one of America's best litigators in the country, not only in the criminal arena, but likewise in the civil arena. He's got uh, uh, awards that uh, only us amateurs can only marvel at. <laughs> <laughs> well, hey, that's a nice compliment. Uh, well, right there. Big guy yeah, right no, there. Jim's <laughs> hardly an amateur. <laughs> well, and to have the opportunity at the Bijou Theater, you're going to go in depth um, about the case. You're going to talk about the docu series. We are. We're going to we're going to talk about the uh, about the documentary series. I'm going to be showing some clips that uh, were not in the series that I think people will find very interesting and entertaining. And we're also going to be talking about some of the larger issues that are raised uh, by the documentary. And that's really why I wanted Jim to be there so that we can have a real discussion about some of the things that he and I have cared about for decades. You know, things like junk science, you know, s scientists coming in and testifying to things that are way beyond their area of expertise. Uh, or uh, the methods to improve the criminal justice system right. as a whole. And what competing interests people in the real life have with each other as a trial progresses. And, you know, people now have, because if they watch the staircase, they see sort of the inner workings uh, and they see some of the problems with their own eyes. And that, I think, has really presented an opportunity for people to get more involved than they were previously. So what's next for you? Uh, I'm, uh, I'm, I've got a book proposal in, uh, so uh, we'll see how that goes. Uh, I've got lots of speaking engagements uh, all over, uh, and that's, uh, that's enjoyable. And then, of course, I've got my, uh, my normal cases, uh, which I'm still trucking with. So it sounds now like you're not doing that. much. No. <laughs> just just take, out? Is just, that what's going on? It's semi-retirement. Unbelievable. <laughs> We're going to give him Saturday off. <laughs> <laughs> that's right. Um, ha, ha, can, do folks need to get tickets ahead of time? Yes. You know, how do they, what do they need to do on this? Uh, there is, uh, if you contact the Bijou Theater mm -hmm. uh, or go to the web page, right. there's a set of instructions about how to get tickets. Okay. KnoxBijou.org. Yes. There you'll find the tickets Thursday, October 25th, going to be at 8 p.m., and will be absolutely fascinating. It, it will be fascinating. It's going to be a great show. I really hope people come out and listen to us. Uh, I think they will. And we sure. get to bring in Bob Thomas, uh, who's going to MC it, and everybody loves Bob. So, Terrific. Sounds right. like a special Thank night. you all for having us yeah. so much. Yeah, we appreciate it. Thanks for giving us your time. We I know. Thank you. All right. Good to see both of you.